You know, typically when you get a heavy package in the mail, usually mean that it's gonna be a good day. So let's get into this little unboxing that we got here. So, today we've got the Anderson's Designs Fabrication lift kit for a 2004 Subaru Forester XT. Uh, this specific kit, I believe, want to say works from the 1999 to the 2008, I believe, Subaru Forester XG. No, sorry about that. SG, my correction. So, let's go ahead and uh, I did already open the box. You know, I got a little excited when I got here. But uh, it's basically going to be an unboxing. Just kind of want to show the quality of the parts, um, you know, kind of what came in the box that we can kind of see. Uh, I ordered these guys on a Monday, and on a holiday Monday, um, and they got here to me within about four days. So, it, granted, I am in central Washington and they are in Oregon, but uh, they still got here very fast. So I was very pleased with that. Um, quality looks great, but enough talking, and let's get down into this thing. Right. So here we go. Heavy box, heavy box. So this is our Anderson's Designs lift kit for an SG Subaru Forester. Like I said, I did already open the box. Um, everything in here came very nicely packaged up. Foam, cardboard. They packaged it great. No complaints on that. Um, but just get right into it. There's one of the strut spacers, as you can see right there. It's for the front. The welds on this thing look very clean. The finish on them is also very nice. They coated them, they're great. So basically in this box here, you're gonna have your two front strut spacers. Uh, the kit that I ordered, I ordered the kit with the uh, trailing arm spacers as well. So here are your two trailing arm spacers. We'll get one of those open here in a bit. Haven't looked at one of those yet. And then of course your two rear strut top spacers. So as you can see, the rear is just a bit bigger. So I went with a two inch in the front and a two and a half in the rear to kind of compensate for uh, some of that load. Uh, in the future, I do plan on potentially putting a rooftop tent on the vehicle. So you know kind of got to get that rear end up a little higher um, on top of that I'll probably end up putting either some uh, well, more than likely some king springs on the rear as well probably on the front too but I'll come down the road um, on my Forester currently right now I am running might as well just get right here um, on my Forester right now I'm currently running the uh, Yokohama Geolanders in a 270 65 16 I believe I'm pretty sure um, I had a full car people two big guys in the back um, myself and my girlfriend in the front and I was up in the mountains and I was rubbing it was rubbing um, after that we went to go down basically to get firewood and we put firewood in the back and then it started rubbing even more so after that I learned that lesson it was time for that ADF lift. I looked at a lot of the other companies and something about this company just rubbed me the right way. <laughs> uh, so that was the reason why I went with this company. Not saying that any other company is better, worse, whatever. It's, it's each his own. Uh, lastly in this box here, we've got hardware and we've got more hardware. Uh, and then also, can't forget this. That Anderson's design fabrication sticker, which is definitely going to be going on the back. So that's pretty much what you get here in the box. Um, we'll just pop one of these guys open here really quick. Might as well take a look at this. I've read the install directions multiple times now because even before I had this kit, there's the trailing arm spacer. Um, read the direction multiple times. It seems like a pretty self explanatory, very easy install. So once I get to that point and I'm ready to actually get this kit installed, which 
my girlfriend drives this vehicle that we have to work and she's currently working on the weekends right now which sucks so I can't work on it because I work Monday through Friday um, and usually when I'm home she's at work and when she's at home I'm at work so that kind of sucks but sooner than later I'll get it installed uh, I am gonna do an installation video for it as well uh, it's kind of a I'm gonna try to do as best as I can a step-by-step -step. I am kind of new to this YouTube thing but trying to make something of it so we'll give that a shot uh, that way, hopefully, if anybody else has any questions out there on how to, you know, install things, get things placed, get things hooked back up, uh, you know, hopefully this video will, will answer them. Uh, but yeah, so stay tuned for an install video. So that's basically uh, the conclusion of this unboxing video from the Anderson's Designs Fabrication uh, Strut and Trailing Arm Spacer Lift Kit. Uh, like I said, uh, stay tuned for a lift kit video coming up in the very near future. Uh, if you've got an Instagram account, follow me, please, uh, if you can, at uh, WRXN underscore TY. Uh, that's where I, my personal account is pretty much where I post photos, videos, or anything of the WRX build and the uh, Forester build. Um, WRX is broken again currently right now, unfortunately. So i got to get under it this weekend and see what the heck's going on. Uh, also, please like comment subscribe to my channel um, really trying to pursue this whole YouTube thing seems pretty fun pretty cool I uh, just want to stick with it keep going uh, keep with that motivation so uh, also lastly uh, Instagram follow my uh, merchandising company just small just started it uh, it's at JDM underscore a posse and I will put the uh, my username right down here <laughs> so you'll see that right there uh, so this is the first run of shirts. This is the front, and if you can kind of see, that is the back. So this is just the first run of shirts. Um, you can message me on my personal Instagram account to order. Uh, they're $25 shipped, and uh, I've got a limited run of the first batch. Uh, but I'd like to keep pushing, keep pushing, keep selling shirts, and uh, come out with some other other designs. So. Uh, yeah, thank you guys for watching. I really appreciate it, and y'all have a good one.